Tyrese Rice, born May 15, 1987. The ACC is arguably the best conference to play in in the NCAA, and from 2005 to 2009, Rice was arguably the conference's best player, or guard at least. You had guards like Ty Lawson, Grievous Vasquez, Sean Singletary, and Ish Smith, but Tyrese Rice was considered by some as the best, if not one of. He drew many comparisons to NBA greats, but unlike them, didn't get a chance to wear an NBA jersey. Let's look at three reasons I think that opportunity eluded him. Salute to Petty Murphy and everyone that's been requesting this guy. I know it's took some time, but it's finally here. It's your boy JC Stunner Growth. Get her. Rice attended L.C. Bird High School in Chesterfield, Virginia. As a senior, he averaged 27 points, 6.2 assists, and 5 rebounds per game. He earned 2004-2005 Associated Press Virginia Co-Player of the Year honors and was named Richmond Times Dispatch Player of the Year. Despite this, he wasn't highly ranked out of high school and chose to attend Boston College over Virginia Tech and Maryland. Stunt number one, turn down the volume. Tyrese Rice stepped into Boston College and immediately started getting his shots up. Although he wasn't a starter that year, he wasn't shy about shooting the ball. He shot four and a half threes a game as a freshman, and that would be his lowest amount in four years. Along with a rocket arm from three and from two, he turned the ball over almost as much as he assisted it. While I'm all for a guy shooting the ball at any open chance he gets, when you're 5'11", 6 foot, a shoot first point guard, and turn the ball over as much as he did, you're not attractive in the eyes of the people that matter. The quick shooting lefty quickly made a name for himself with his unrattled nature and heart when playing the top teams in the conference and the country. In 2005, he was named to the All-ACC Freshman Team and averaged 9 points, 2.5 assists, and 2.1 turnovers a game. He shot 39% from three and helped take his team to the regional semifinals of the NCAA tournament where they lost to number one Villanova. They were 28 and 8 on the season and ranked third in the ACC. Every season but his last at Boston College, his shot attempts rose along with his turnovers. As a sophomore, he was the second leading scorer on the team behind Jared Dudley, who eventually went to the NBA. As a junior, he was the clear-cut leader on the team as a scorer, with Dudley and Craig Smith gone. But the team was really bad at just 14 and 17, 4 and 12 in the conference. Not to say that he shot the ball too much, because he had to at times, just noting the perception it gave off. Stunt number two, point guard year. The 2009 NBA draft where Tyrese Rice went undrafted was one of the most point guard heavy drafts of all time. Of the 60 players taken that year, 20 of them were point guards, 13 in the first round alone. This particular draft had every kind of point guard you could think of. The shooter, tall athletic, diminutive but exciting, the pass first, the guy that could do it all, and the high potential slash high risk guy. Tyrese simply didn't push any of these categories to the max. He wasn't the best scorer, he wasn't tall or athletic, he wasn't the best passer or pure point guard, and he wasn't the fastest at that time. He wasn't even the best lefty. That was a really tough draft to be taken in, and unfortunately, he didn't stand out amongst the abundance of guys that were. Add to that, his teams never really made much noise outside of the years Craig Smith and Jared Dudley were the leaders. Make matters worse, his numbers dipped from his junior to senior year, his turnovers were up, and his shooting went down as well. Maybe if he had left after his junior year, he may have had a shot, but after a senior year like that and a heavy point guard draft class in 2009 made him go overlooked. Stunt number three, show me the money. Tyrese Rice is a really good player that I think should have gotten a shot right out of school. I'm just telling you what I think it looks like. The final reason he didn't is simply because he didn't want to. After going undrafted, Rice went overseas where he's had one of the best European careers of any point guard in recent years. He would immediately play in the Greek League for the 2009-10 season. The next year, Germany's basketball Bundesliga, the top league in the country for a team called Artland. 
In 2013, he played for one of the most popular teams overseas in Maccabi Tel Aviv. In his first season with them, in the semi-final game, he was responsible for the 68-67 victory over CSKA Moscow by scoring the game winner with 5.5 seconds left on the clock. In the championship final game against Real Madrid, he scored 26 points, leading his team to a sixth European title. He was named the finals MVP and an absolute star that people to this day still remember whenever he returned to the country. In 2014, he would sign with Kimki, a Russian team where he was named the season MVP and won the Euro Cup, where he was also the finals MVP. If it were anyone that embraced life overseas and made the best of going undrafted, it was this guy. At this point, the NBA finally came calling and he had opportunities to make his dream come true. In Rice's words though, NBA was always the ultimate goal, always number one. But I've also been in situations where I couldn't turn down the money or take less money to go to the NBA. Also, I didn't want to hop into a role where I didn't have a chance to showcase. It's very tricky in that way in the NBA. I just decided to stay where I was. I wouldn't necessarily call it a stunt because it was his choice, like he said, to stay where he was and continue the success he was having, but it is a reason why he's not there. I gotta respect it. He would go on to win more MVPs and become an even bigger star. Salute to Tyrese, man. Many people wanted a feature on him and I'm happy he still got paid like an NBA player and made it out for a guy his size and underrated college career. His fans swear by him and I can see why. Wish him nothing but the best. It's your boy JC, Stunted Growth, and I'm out.